everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Vlogmas week three. Oh my god, I can't believe it's already week three. <laughs> what is going on? I always feel like with December, I'm constantly saying like, where's the time going? Where's the time going? Time just goes so quickly. And then it, it's just like, what? What? I'm so glad I started my shopping early November because if I started in December, I would be stressed right now. So stressed. So if you guys haven't started, start now because it's always like, oh, there's like two weeks left till Christmas. There's this time till Christmas. And then all of a sudden it's gonna come around and you'll be like, crap, I've got nothing. <laughs> Sorry, I've got my scarf on. I've just come home. I've been to the doctors this morning. I need to get more prescription of my pill. And I came in and it was freezing. I was like, oh my God, and Lottie was under so many blankets. And the heating was on, but it just wasn't on full. So I've just put the heating on because it's quite chilly here. But I love this weather so much. It's not my favourite weather ever. So, this week, me and Bradley... I feel like Vlogmas is very much like me and Bradley. It's not just my videos. So, this week, we are having a chilled week. And then Friday, he's got off. And I am so excited about it. Because Friday, we... I think we're going to go to London, I think. And it would be so lovely to take you guys along with us. So, I think we're going to go to London. We'll probably get a train or something. We haven't done anything like that ever. Like, literally ever. In the three years we've been together, we've never just had, like, a nice day in London if it hasn't involved like any work or anything like that ever and to be honest Bradley's really he hates shopping so much but we're just gonna have a nice chill day in London and I said to him to be honest we've got most of our Christmas stuff like all the presents and stuff for everyone so it'd be nice to just get oh can you see that hair there we go It'll be nice to just get like last minute bits and then also bits that we want. I feel like it's acceptable to get things for yourself when you've got everyone else's, so I'm happy about that. So yeah, that's Friday. Um, I'm looking if we can stay on Friday night until Saturday because that'll make our lives 10 times easier. But I don't know, I feel like it's quite late notice now. I'm gonna see if there's any hotels available right now. Um, after I film this little bit, I'll go on my computer, just have a little look. But yeah, I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure, but anyway, you guys will know because you're in this video anyway. Anyway, to start off Vlogmas week three, I have just had a knock on my door from one of my favorite brands. I have opened it. I haven't looked inside it yet. I was like, no, I need to wait. I need to wait. Um, obviously, this is misguided, as you can tell by the... Oh, God, my laptop's falling. Ah! Real good. As you can tell, that was misguided. I just wanted to do a little haul because I love misguided so much. They're my favorite. Just to start off Vlogmas week three, I'm so sorry I keep playing with my hair. Right, let me brush it and then I'll stop. Okay. It's just not going right at the moment. I'm getting used to it because I've never had these extensions before. It's really, it, it takes me a while to just get used to it. And like, I don't know, I love them. I love them, but it's just gonna take me a while to get used to it. Okay, yeah, so I thought I'd do a little mini misguided haul just to start things off for Vlogmas week three. And um, the first things I wanted to show you guys, let me see what size of these are. I think these are a seven I got. Yeah. Um, just to start things off, I got some shoes. So I feel like I just need a basic pair of white trainers. Now, I got these before previously, and I've had them for so long. But the last time I got a size 6, they were tiny. Like, they were literally probably like a 4 or 5. They were so small. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to size up and get a size 7. And to be honest, they look like a size 6. So happy about that. I feel like basic white trainers like this are so handy just to have in your wardrobe. They go with everything. You just slip them on. And you're good to go. These will probably be good for Friday. Oh no, I've got boots for Friday actually. I wear my boots. But um, yeah, love them. Oh my god, I'm so excited about these. So I picked up some joggers. And I can't get over... Look how nice these are at the top. They're like riffled or what would you say? They're called grey paper bag joggers. By the way, I will link everything that I show you guys in the video down below. So yeah, I'll link them all down below. Um, they're like this. So they're quite like baggy joggers. But then they've got really lovely pockets of... And then they've just got a really nice waistband and it's like, is it ruffled? A bit ruffled? Is that the right word? I don't know. But I saw these online and I was like, oh my god, these are so cute. And to be honest, they are thick. Like, these are thick. These will keep you warm. Happy with them. Oh, the next thing I picked up were some pyjamas. Now, these are like black satin, but they've got a really lovely leopard print on them. I thought these are absolutely stunning. So the trousers are just long and flared and then the top is like this how cute is that i can't wait to wear these tonight i absolutely love pajamas if you've watched me for a while you will know that i am like a hoarder sorry i keep touching the bulbul i am like a hoarder when it comes to pajamas i have a serious issue a serious issue it's it's a problem i reckon i actually have a bit of an obsession i have an obsession with pajamas and cushions i don't i don't know why i don't know where this has come from it's been a developing issue for years now and <laughs> i don't know how to handle it every time i go shopping 
I have to buy pajamas and I don't know why. Like my Primark haul, which I don't know if it, I don't know if it's going to be out yet. I think it might be out a day after this video. I can't remember, but I filmed it already. Um I had to buy pajamas and I don't know why. I don't know why. There's I just feel like there's no better feeling than getting in a brand new pair of pajamas. God, I've got issues. I've got issues. The next pair oh my god these are so cute the next pair of shoes well these are slippers actually of slippers that i wanted to show you are these beautiful ones now these are really fluffy they are so lovely you guys know i'm obsessed with slippers and i saw these and i was like oh my god these look lovely so yeah love these i love those the next thing i got was this really lovely onesie it's like a jersey onesie um it's got a lovely pocket here it ties at the waist and it's sort of like trackies in one it's really it's quite thin material but like like good thin it's not like see-through or anything i say that is that see-through no it's just the lighting coming from there <laughs> but you can't see me or anything um i have these with the long sleeve and i really wanted to get the short sleeve because days where you're a little bit hotter or you're cleaning i feel like this is an ideal outfit for cleaning you can just put this on put a cardio over the top if you're getting hot take it off do you know what i mean so i just thought that's quite nice just to have just to have i also picked up this onesie as well look guys obviously i work from home i want to be cozy but in the mornings i like to get ready for the day because i'm all motivated so instead of staying in pajamas all day which i wish i could i like to get ready and i like to wear a lot of loungewear because i feel like it's just it's just it makes sense so i got this one this is like a onesie all in one it ties up at the waist has this got pockets oh my god it doesn't have pockets and it's just quite cute to be honest it's quite there's nothing it's quite self-explanatory really it's just like this and then the joggers at the ends have got this tie which i think is perfect so yeah Sorry, it's really hard to show you. I'm so excited for this next one. I picked up some loungewear. I've already got this in like a pinky colour. So this is the top. It's just like up high like this, like this, like this. And then the joggers. I need some black joggers anyway, so I can wear these together or on its own. The waistband's really thick and stretchy. And then it's got pockets. It's got pockets. And then it goes all the way down like this. And they're just really lovely material. I like the sort of lines on it. I feel like they're quite flattering. So I'm excited to wear these. These are so soft, like so soft. So yes, I'm excited to wear them. It's really cold. Sorry, I need to put my scarf back on because it's, it's cold. Next thing I have are, I'm not gonna lie, and I have another pair of pajamas. So they look like this and they've got this gorgeous print on. Can you see? And it's got like leopards and flowers and bits and bobs like that. So I thought these are just so lovely. So that's the top. And then the bottoms are shorts. They've got a tie at the waist, which I think is so cute. And then they just look like this. Oh, I can't wait to wear these. Which ones do I wear tonight? I've got two to choose from. That's quite handy. They've just put some tampons in there. That's actually a really good idea just to have like in deliveries like this. I think you get three in here. That's really nice. How cute is that? Do you know when you like don't have anything and one day you just come on and you're like, oh crap, I've got nothing. Like these are good just to keep in your drawer, just to have. Oh, that's a really cute gift. I love how I'm getting like, oh, about tampons. But if you're a girl, you know. And then the last things I picked up were jewellery. Oh, these are really cute. So the first one, this was seven pounds. Um, and it's just a layered necklace, but it looks like this, as you can see. And this just, I think it's quite cute. It's got like coins and stuff that's the first one the next things i picked up were some earrings these i thought were ideal for the christmas period so they're like gold but they've got silver sort of studs on them or like gems you'd say oh yeah i thought these looked quite cute oh, i'm really excited to wear these i also got some silver necklaces these are like chokers they were 12 pounds as you can see and i just these were really cute i am more of a silver kind of gal on a day-to-day -day basis i think i definitely wear silver a lot more but then when i want to dress my outfit up a little bit i'll go with gold i don't know why i do that but i just do it's a thing it's a thing um this necklace is a bit tank oh my god this is so nice <gasps> so this was six pounds and it looks like this it's got these beautiful stud detailings on it and then the gem is like this can you see it's like a little diamond obviously it's not real but oh my god this is such a lovely everyday necklace oh i love that love and then the last pair of earrings i got were these i just thought these were really different like really different but i really like them I feel like they look really cute. Like, do you know what I mean? I feel, I don't know, they're a bit different. They're different. Yeah, that was my mini misguided haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, the rest of the week, today is currently Wednesday. 
Um, like I said, I've been to the doctors already, had that appointment, and then, uh, to be honest, the rest of the day I don't need to film, apart from Vlogmas, I don't need to sit down and film, which is great. I filmed two videos yesterday, so I need to edit them today. It's a pretty chill day. I do need to clean. I need to clean because everything's just a state in this house. But the thing is, it's really hard to like clean and organize because my beauty room is absolutely filled with presents and there's nowhere else they can go. So everything just looks a mess because of that. So I said to Bradley, one thing, one thing, the, o the only thing I'm looking forward to when Christmas is finished is to have space back because we live in such a tiny home that we have no space for anything. So that's hard. And we do have a loft, but then everything's gonna get dusty if we put it up there. And it's just, it's one of those things where it's just like, oh, may as well wait a few weeks, but it's just hard. So it's just annoying. I need to tidy, but looking at it, it's tidy, but it doesn't look tidy because of the present. So I'm just like, <laughs> I'm all stressed. Um, anyway, first blood problems, I know, I know. There's a lot more going on in the world than to worry about that But it's just one of those things where I'm waking up and because I work from home I'm constantly seeing it and it's constantly on my mind, but then I can't do anything about it So I'm like I've just got to leave it and just just don't stress. It's fine <laughs> But yes, that is literally me for the rest of the day and I am very excited about it I've currently got a blanket. I've got my laptop and I'm gonna put the holiday on because it's my favorite film And I'm just gonna chill. It's currently 20 past 11 I feel like I've done a lot already today like out and about and I'm just like uh, I can't wait to just sit and chill and I'm excited and put all my new stuff away because I love stuff <laughs> but um yeah I hope you guys are enjoying my vlogmas so far I felt like my vlogmas week two was a little bit boring I'm not gonna lie to you but I suppose not all vlogs are gonna be really fun and outgoing do you know what I mean it's gonna be up and down here and there it was just a busy week and because I'm filming so much behind the scenes as well as vlogmas a lot is going on but I feel like this week will be a lot different because I've pre-filmed a lot already so we're all good anyway 18 minutes in I need to mm, and I will see you when I next see you I don't know when that'll be but you guys will in the next game to be given how lucky can this so hard be and I fall into peace and silence Day. Bradley's got the day off. I feel like. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> right, you put this down by your feet. So yeah. One sec. We need to quickly do the in. Do this first, because I want to start driving. Because we're wasting time, baby. Right, I'm gonna have to hold you here. Today is what day, Bradley? Friday. And what are we doing today? Shopping day. Where? Bista, Bista Village. Whoop, whoop. We're gonna go to Bista Village, and I'm so oh, excited. Oh, yeah. Bradley's happy. What is that? Breakfast wrap. <gasps> Goodness. Um, yeah, we're so excited. We're gonna go to Bristol Village. We have just picked us up some breakfast and then we are gonna go and pick my sister up and her little baby and they're gonna come with us. Bradley's just enjoying his breakfast wrap in the camera. <laughs> Enjoy that. <laughs> um, and we're gonna do some late minute shopping, which is great. I'm excited, so let's go. You excited? Very. Are you excited? Lottie can't come with us, sadly. We're going to drop her off at Bradley's mum and dad's. Let's go. The wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I want to be. I'll be home for a couple of days Wander around with you 
You and me in the cold Thought it'd never be true Wherever I go I got you Oh, I have stopped running There is no way trying You better loosen your belt Drinking hot wine by the fire Don't care of anything else It's Christmas And some kind of love, my friend I pray it will never end Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas. We're now in a restaurant. Oh, I was going to say, oh, I didn't see it so well. What's it called? Farmhouse. Farmhouse. <laughs> um, Emily was here, but she's gone now. What are you doing? Robert Welch. Oh. Um, but we're just waiting to eat. We've been shopping. Bradley's looking at himself. Need to shave. Mm -hmm. Um. And then after this, we're going to go and get some mulled wine or hot chalk. What do you reckon? You don't want mulled wine, do you? Hot chalk. Hot chalk. Or coffee, because I've got dry time. We can get coffee after as well. We'll see. We'll see. And then we're going to shop again after. Thanks, baby! What are you having? Whoa. <laughs> it's now time of the year. Drinking hot wine by the fire yeah. Here on our own we got nothing to fear It's Christmas And some kind of love, my friend Pick up some candy canes And hang a wreath on your door It's Christmas And outside snow's glistening just you and me tonight It's just you and me tonight It's just you and me tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you In the quiet evening snow is falling And from every window shines a light Somewhere in the distance drums are calling But no one heeds their call Sponsored by Tommy Han. We are now home. The journey home was so quick, wasn't it? How long did it take? Um, 45 minutes. Mm. Of course, got into my pyjamas and dressing gown straight away, which is the nicest thing ever. Take um, for my purse. Yes. And I thought I'd show you guys. And that's my club card. You're not taking my club card. Okay. Why are you taking my club card? Really. You had the keychain and then you lost the keychain. So you can get it on the app. Did you know that? Have you signed my club card? I'm going to quickly pause it. She's been at Bradley's mum and dad's all day, haven't you? Um, I thought oh, I'd show. Sorry, but um, I can keep change from now on. No. Yeah. Change is my thing. Right. It, that's been a rule. Every time Bradley has change, he has to give it to me. It's like a thing. It is a thing. You're not taking that away from me. He's not. I've paused the telly. Oh, on Amazon. This isn't a spawn. But we've put all the lights on. We're all cosy. I don't know how Bradley's still in jeans. I'm surprised you haven't taken all your clothes off yet. They're not. Okay, so I thought I would do a little unboxing of everything I got today. This bag... Bradley secretly got me something for Christmas and I'm not allowed to open it until Christmas, is it? Am I not allowed to open this until Christmas? Mm. Hello? Or should I open it now? Hello? Early Christmas present? No. What do I do with it? Under the tree. Okay. Actually. So, these are the stuff that I got today. Oh, and I got Bradley some shoes. Because I'm a nice girlfriend like that. But um, I thought I'd show you everything that I got. I didn't actually pick these up at Mr Village because there isn't a next home but next just sent me some 
magazines and I don't know why but I'm gonna have a look through them tonight there's it's like an actual book it feels so nice it's like an actual book so I'm excited to go through them tonight because I love next and I love next time it's the best thing anyway let's start small to big so estate order companies it was from this place the cosmetic company store all I picked up was this is how I do with one hand up the pseudo fix fluid foundation from matte in nc30 i think this will be my shade it looked it in the bottle um it's usually 27 pounds is that gonna focus it's usually 27 pounds and i got it for 18 which is really good obviously so i'm excited to try this because all my foundations are drugstore or primark so i don't have any like higher end ones and i've heard good things so i wanted to try that from the white company don't mind there's like jewelry and stuff over there from the white company i got so from the white company i picked up the white lily home spray this smelled so lovely and i think it was yeah 10 pound 67 which is crazy and it's usually 16 pounds i wish they had white lily in a diffuser i've got the what's this one <laughs> was that not good enough do i need to shut up yeah sorry um this is the white company winter diffuser but i wish they had it in white lily just for an everyday scent because obviously that's very christmasy but i'd love this for an everyday scent but anyway there's a room spray so that's not so bad from michael kors i feel like with michael kors it's kind of an old designer brand um and we went into like chloe and places like that but i didn't want to spend a couple of grand on a bag especially at christmas time I just thought it wasn't sensible and I walked in and I saw this and I was like I actually really like it like Michael Kors is sort of a more affordable designer which is good so anyway I'll show you what I picked up and I actually really like them so the first thing I got was a little purse so this is what the purse looks like it's just very like thin and slick and this is what I've wanted for so long I don't like bulky purses I just don't because all my bags are quite small I like to just sort of fit something in it so it's really compact this was 89 it was 89 pounds a purse it was I don't know um but I love it it also comes which I think is such a good idea with a little card holder as well so if you're going on nights out which I don't actually do that often it's good to just have your cards in there or if you're going to the shops you can just pull your main cards out from that bit um, it's got a little compartment here for your change um, and your notes here but I just thought it's a really good purse I really liked it so yes and then obviously I had to get something matching in here so this is the bag that I picked I just loved it I don't know why these bags aren't usually ones that I go for but I don't know why I loved it it's got like this really lovely Saffiano leather um, and I just like the whole detailing of the bag. I just think it looks really lovely. So that's the one I got. All my purchases from today. And then obviously I got Bradley's shoes for him. But I just thought that's quite a nice sort of everyday. Don't mind my washing, by the way. <laughs> but like a nice everyday sort of bag. Look. Bradley, do you like it? What? My bag. So lovely. <laughs> are you being sarcastic no no it's actually really nice do you like it yeah do you like your shoes yes have you shown your friends yes what have they said billy holiday replied said my granddad has them oh i think they're lovely i actually love them do you like them wow what loads of t and h's awesome glad i just got you them and you've thrown them back well, in the box them. thanks a lot i'm gonna take these back i'm gonna drive Go all the on, way man. to bista like you would drive back there by yourself no i wouldn't i'd be just getting right this isn't this isn't this situation needs to needs to get sorted because this can't be happening in the vlog hun anyway while bradley continues to ignore me i'm going to sit here drink my orange juice Mm. watch some christmas films get all cozy it was so christmasy today wasn't it it was so cute i want to go back again but we need to save up a little bit more money and then go back again <laughs> don't we <laughs> I, don't. I love it when i vlog with bradley and he just ignores me it's well because sometimes you're talking to the camera and sometimes you're talking to me why can't you listen sorry what did you say did you just pick your nose yes 
I'm exposing Bradley, everyone. Right, what have you got to say to everyone? Other than picking your nose. I want to ask you what you were saying. I forgot now. <laughs> it can't be that important. No way, that is my last bit of orange juice. Are you joking? <sighs> it's better. Are you actually... Look at him. Now he's got his new shoes, he's gone all smug. Oh, Lottie, what's he like? Anyway, yeah, we're just gonna chill tonight and I'm not happy with him. Right, hello everybody. We are now in bed. Um, I think Lottie's trying to get out of the bed. Lottie! So we've showered, I've done my skincare, and I just feel so nice and fresh. Got in our pyjamas. Bradlina's here. Say hello. Hello! <laughs> Lottie's here with her treat. Who are your treat? Um, and we're just chilling. It was so cute when I was in the shower where I got out and look what Bradley put on the deli for me. Because it's my favourite. Please don't mind the mess. Don't mind the mess, but I love fires. And look, put a little wax melt there for me because obviously we don't have a fire or anything. We rent our flat, so I can't wait to just buy a house and just have a fireplace. I'm so excited about it. Um, anyway, this weekend, so it's currently Friday. Tomorrow we are, I keep forgetting what the plan is. Oh, so we're gonna basically tidy up the flat. I haven't seen the flat this messy in a long time and it stresses me out. So we're gonna clean and organize everything. My beauty room, I, honestly, I haven't been able to do any sort of mirror pictures or anything like that for my Instagram because there's no room, there is no room. So I'm just, I'm just so stressed about that, I can't handle it. Um, but I sort of need to organise it properly and we need to dust over. We just need a good clean because we've been so busy, haven't we? The past, he's not going to listen, but the past like couple of weeks we've been so busy. So it needs a good old clean, doesn't it? Yes, your yes. favourite thing to do? I love it. You've got your phone call. Yeah, we're just going to chill in bed. So tomorrow we're going to clean. But we're basically going to get up whenever we want. Um, and then in the evening we've got Bradley's auntie's birthday. So we're going to go to that. And then Sunday, we've just got a nice chill day. We're gonna go to Carluccio's for brunch, I think, which would be nice. Their food is so nice. So I think we're gonna do that, but it sort of depends on the weather and our vibe. <sighs> it is gonna rain. What are you most looking forward to about this weekend? <sighs> Spending time with you. What else? And Liverpool playing. Bradley prioritizes Liverpool, I bet. I literally just said you first. You you have more of a grin when you said about Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, Liverpool's only on for 90 minutes of the weekend, but I'm with you for the other hours of the day. Anyway, um, I don't think I'll ever understand Liverpool. It's just not, not even Liverpool, football. I just don't understand it. It's just not my thing. But anyway, that's our plan for the weekend. Um, and I'm actually really excited about it. I'm just excited to just organise. And you know when you feel like when you're organising stuff, your mind is then clear. I can't wait for that feeling. I'm so excited about it. So I'm excited. Um, and also, please don't mind what I look like on my lashes. I can't cope. Normally, if you follow me for a while, you will know that I always have individual lashes in. Always. But I haven't got any. <laughs> and I feel really naked. And it's just really weird. Do you like it when I have them or not? <laughs> I'm not bothered whether you have them or not. Would you actually prefer that? I'd prefer it with, I think. Anyway. I would I'd prefer it if they weren't straight. Yeah, because the lashes of... Obviously, when you get individuals, it pushes your lashes down. So my lashes are quite straight now. Um, I need to use my eyelash curler. You should get a lash lift after you get them done. But anyway, rambling now, I know. But um, that's our plan for the weekend. And I'm very excited about it. And I'm very excited to bring you guys along too. Are you excited, Bradley? I'm so excited. Everyone likes it when you join the vlogs. And I just can't hide it. I'm about to lose control and I think I like it. <laughs> Let's see. She's like, oh, mum and dad, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hello. Hello, darling. Say hello to everybody. Say hello. Hello. Anyway. We'll see you in the morning. So we'll see you in the morning. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> it's now Sunday. 
yesterday I actually what are you doing? See this air coming out the road. Oh, you went to the left lane. Yesterday I forgot to vlog, but to be honest, we didn't actually do a lot. We just cleaned all day long and then went to Bradley's aunties in the evening and that was it. So it was quite a nice day. Quite chilled. I'm so sorry about this light, it's the worst lighting ever. Um we were gonna go for brunch. But we're adults, so we're now on our way to Tesco's to do our weekly shop. Are you excited about it, Bradley? Now? Can't wait. <laughs> um, and we're actually meeting Bradley's mum and dad, which is going to be nice. I can't see. Anyway, we'll see you when you get there because this lighting is too annoying. Hello. Here at Tesco's, as you can see, and it is so busy. Like, crazy busy. But... Is my camera foggy? Leave in this space. Yeah. So do I go down this one? When you've got, when you're parking, you need to look for people walking. Yeah. To their car. Right. So back with Bradlina. We've just been to Tesco's, done our shop, and we are now on our way to TK Maxx <laughs> and Nando's because it's currently twenty past three. We weren't sure whether to get Nando's now or later. We did say we wanted it, didn't we? I love it when I talk too many. Sorry, I'm like, trying to concentrate on driving. It's great. It's great. Um, but yeah, we're also going to go to TK Maxx as well because it's next door and it's my favourite. Oh, oh, <laughs> that bump. Hello. Oh, you've been nice. Hello. Hello. So that's our plan. And I'll show you guys what's in TK Maxx, which is new because it's my fave. Is it your fave? It's my fave. Yeah. So look, TK we're here now. So TK Maxx and then Nando's. Where should we park? Oh, there's a space there. You missed it. Oh, here. Okay, good one. Oh, it looks so busy in there. Oh, I'm so excited. Should we get takeaway now, Do you want one? Don't mind. I'd, it just makes sense to eat there. I was so zoomed in then. I thought I was zoomed in. Um. Anyway, let's go. Hello. <laughs> currently sat here on the sofa editing this video <laughs> which is going up Monday which is the day of seeing this and I'm editing this on a Sunday um, Bradley's currently sitting down if you want to know we are chilling in the front room he's playing is it GTA you're playing mm -hmm. today GTA got Lottie here hello darling what are you doing what are you doing <laughs> she's getting all excited um, and I forgot to say goodbye but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's so much fun to edit because I don't know, I just feel like it's gonna be so nice to look back at this video soon. Did you enjoy it, Bradley, going to Bista and stuff? Yeah, it was so much fun. We had so much fun. Um, and I can't wait to do something like that again soon. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bradley, what do I have to do? Like, subscribe, yeah. and leave a nice comment yeah. below. Yeah. 
and then let's see. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this Vlogmas week three. And make sure you're back for more videos. And make sure you're back for Vlogmas week four as well, which will be so exciting because that's the last one before Christmas. So weird, it's gone so quickly, isn't it? So weird, so weird. But um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next video, which is actually going up tomorrow, and it's a Primark haul. Which is, I haven't told anyone yet, but um, yeah, it's a whole. Primark oh, I'm in it. Primark one? Yeah. No, you're not. Oh, no, I'm not. I went to Primark with you, though. <laughs> yeah. I did say to you, do you want to film the haul with me? You said, mmm. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Come back tomorrow for a Primark haul, it's a good one. And I will hopefully see you soon. Hopefully, see you tomorrow. But yeah, love you. Say goodbye.